and it is time for our bet on it segment segment brought to you by warhorse sportsbook the best place in nebraska to place your sports bets you can do it at uh, the Warhorse Sportsbook in Lincoln or Omaha. Got you covered both places. And it is, as I mentioned, the best place to place your sports bets. Keep your money on the Nebraska side of the river by placing your bets on nearly every major sporting event and all types of different bets, parlays, props, in-game bets. You know I like those in-game bets, DB. I like the yeah, value yes, you, you do. get there. Yes, you do. And I like the value you get going to Warhorse Sportsbook. No bets no glory. What are we betting on here today, DB? It's what I've been thinking about for a couple of days. Oh Lord, here what? we go. What? 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 What do you? What do you, what do you think it is? Um, future wins for Nebraska. Yeah. No. Okay. That was yesterday. I felt like I got my piece out. <laughs> I felt like I got my piece out yesterday. <laughs> no, this is a, this is a non Nebraska one for okay. me today. Okay. And I think I'm ready to, I think I'm ready to put my name down on it. I think I'm ready to bet on it. And that's that. Will Howard. Isn't that guy for OSU. So were you surprised that they named him a starter so early? Nope. I, and maybe I'm galaxy braining this thing too much. <laughs> Probably. Probably. It's not the first time that I've done that. I think they did it to try and coalesce support behind him. Coalesce. Is that where we're, so we're, 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 we're overthinking this. There's the galaxy brain. In yeah. It, right. Right. Yeah. Hey, to anoint him. Listen, if you start uh, not being genuine or you lack authenticity in promoting leadership, mm-hmm. you're in trouble. Well, that's fair. You're in trouble. What if it's? Right, we're going through that right now. What if it's close with, with our team internally at the high school level? What if it's close? Leadership is leadership. No, for sure. But I mean, starting quarterback is di- well, can sure. be different from leadership, sure. right? Okay, yeah. Take the take uh take the experience. Play it safe, right? Yeah, that's fine. Yeah, yeah. Go with who you trust and and work your way into. But it. when I say he's not but, that guy, but be careful about. You do have to be careful being enamored with optics. You also have to be careful with if the people in the locker room know. You have to be real careful, right? Yeah. Like if there's, because let's let's bring up Julian saying here, because that's part of the reason I say I'm not sold on Will Howard as that guy at OSU. I first of all, I brought this back. I brought this up way back when he entered the transfer portal, and and people were losing their minds over over Will Howard. Just because you're the best guy in the transfer portal doesn't mean you're the best guy. Yeah, you formula. I don't know if this is in your own head, but what I hear over the last mm-hmm. five months is you've you've convinced yourself he's not very good. I don't think he's not very good. I think he's not what we're making him out to be. There's a difference, right? Okay. I think there's a difference for me personally. Maybe I'm misunderstanding the perception of Will Howard. I just don't know what we think he's going to be, though. Like and how good does he have to be given what they have? Yeah, I don't know. So maybe that's what that's shoot. It's a it's an amazing Daniel thing. Oh no. Maybe we have to reset what we're sure what we think. Like can Ohio Howard State is, win a national championship if Howard is just the good. exact same guy he was at Kansas State? Yeah. So the perception I've taken from it is we expect or the people, the general we expect. Will Howard, since he's going to be around better talent, Mm -hmm. to all of a sudden take this leap. And it wouldn't be the first time. That's happened before, right? That's not necessarily the thing I believe in. I don't think that's going to happen. If Will Howard ends up getting the job done for Ohio State, it will be because he's the exact same guy he was at Kansas State, and that's good enough But in my mind. But you could see leadership qualities, right? For sure. What did we just talk about off air with our own team last year? Yeah. Right? What's what's the difference between – QB 2024 and QB 2023 is the leadership of Anthony Rezac, his ability to command that huddle, command that team. Yeah. So don't like, I'm not, I'm not dismissing it. I'm really, cause not. I, cause like, I like that is the greatest leader mm-hmm. of good players that I've seen in the last 20 years. Yeah. Right. It's one of the same reasons why I have such an affinity for Tommy. It's hard to lead other equal alphas Mm -hmm. it is not easy especially because all of them have probably been leaders at some point so if will howard is the guy yeah and he's leading other guys and they look at him as a leader hey man shout out because it's because it's hard because he's not a pro guy 
he's not he's not Henderson. He's not Judkins. He's not one of their 58 great mm-hmm. wide receiver ones. Like Buka or or he's not Caleb Downs. Don't don't, don't, under, don't undersell that now. So let me ask you this though. <clears throat> what if it's the other side of that coin, right? Because this is how it could go bad. Okay. If it's the other side of that coin, and Will Howard thinks he's that guy, but they are other leaders that are respected more in that locker room already. Do you think they would roll the dice? I don't know. I really don't. I see. I don't. I don't think they would. So here's an interesting. Here, it's too big of a year. No, but here that's why I think they may take chances they wouldn't normally. Because all right, I'm listening. I think Ryan Day has and this isn't an original thought, but has some of the most insane amount of pressure this year of just about any college football coach that we've seen in recent memory because his bar isn't making the playoffs. So this is this is Sands, Pittman, Napier. Oh, I think it's way worse than them. Even Marcus Freeman. Because you can have good years at those places and be fine. You, If you make the college football playoff and you're Ohio State, that's not good enough this year. Have you seen Florida's schedule? Not recently. Yeah. I, 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 am, I assume it's bad. Ugh. But like Napier, if he imp, like Napier, if he makes the college football playoff is good. Like he said, Ryan Day is not in that situation. Ryan Day has to not only make the college football playoff, <clears throat> he has to beat Michigan. And borderline, you have to he kind of has to win the national championship. Like I genuinely believe that. Mm. And hey. that is a really unique position as a head coach. To be like, hey, I know you're awesome and you win a ton of games. Well, that's all the reason to not tinker or dink with right. le- pretend leadership. But when you think if you think there is a if you think there's a reason, whether it's Will Howard's ability, whether it's if you think there's a reason that Will Howard can help you get to something and you're under that amount of pressure, I could see you compromising. Well, I don't know. I don't either. But it, the whole situation makes I, me because on a much smaller scale, this is exactly what we went through. Yeah, last year it's exactly what we went through. But a ton of pressure. Yes, perceived to be really, really good. Yep, the leadership came natural. It did. So, I, so you but don't think at it, the, you don't think that at that level? Not always. What if it doesn't? Like I think it's what, okay. I think so the what, leadership coming naturally is less common than maybe we're giving it credit for. Um, I think it depends a lot on what that locker room and the culture is like. And I don't know in Ohio State. I really don't. I'm not saying it's bad. I I really don't know. Ask me um, me another way. Um, In terms of the leadership emerging naturally? Yeah, because I felt like we had a couple of options. Yeah. But it was clear the direction we, we moved in. So if you do have a couple of options... I mean, and it's not, it doesn't end up being clear. Like, what if part of the team gravitates towards one guy, part of the team gravitates towards another guy, and it's not clear? I mean, you went through this to a certain extent with Tommy and Brooke. That's not who I would have used. I would have used, I would have used Tommy and like Zach. Okay, sure. I would have used a um, couple of defensive guys. But there were certain guys, guys gravitated to. And then there was another guy that certain guys gravitated towards. And if that doesn't naturally is, shape, the, is that leadership, though? I don't know. I think if they gravitate towards you, it's a bonus. Yeah. But I would have to think about if it was necessary. Because I think it guys can easier. gravitate towards Rayola. That doesn't naturally make him a leader. Fair. Yeah. I think that's fair. But he could naturally be but a leader. Here's where that becomes a problem, right? If guys gravitate towards Rayola, if he thinks he's a leader yeah, and feels like he needs to be a leader, but there's other people that probably should be leaders this year. <laughs> like if he thinks he needs to be that guy and isn't that guy that's, yet, that's tough. That's where things get a little messy. If Will Howard thinks he's supposed to be that guy because he's QB1, he got named the starter. He's got some accolades coming from another place where nobody else on that roster in, in the quarterback room has accolades in college football yet, right? Mm-hmm. None of them have played. Even though Julian Sands probably better in terms of pro prospect, Aaron Nolan maybe is better as a full, as a pro prospect. None of them have done what Will Howard's done, but maybe that's not the guy that people look to for leadership. But he feels like he should be. I think this is this might be one of those times where it's better to be a good follower too. Right, but if you have a guy that's not right, a good follower, because right, if I'm if I'm Bo Ryan or I'm I'm 
I'm Caleb or I'm te- like I don't I don't know, man. So, some of that stuff just presents itself naturally. And if they're willing Hopefully. to do that, you think Howard did it naturally? Because because that's what happened with with Anthony. You would hope so. Like it just was. It just it's just how it. It was just natural. That's my bet on it. 